Welcome to tonight's coverage of MIL Football. How are you doing, everybody? We welcome you once again to our live coverage of MIL High School Football here on Maui's ESPN Radio. And tonight we're back at War Memorial Football Stadium for tonight's matchup between the Na'ali'i of King Kikalike as they take on the Maui High Sabres. Glad to have you along. I'm Barry and we are just about ready to get this one underway, and we are underway. A line drive kick. It'll come down inside the 15, picked up by Brown inside the 10. Brings it back out across the 15. To the right side he goes, then comes back the other way. It runs into traffic. Here, two receivers to the left, one to the right. Now the slot man, Ogata, goes in motion, and the snap, and then the pitch to Ramos. And as soon as he got the pitch, he was wrapped up around the leg, knifing his way in there was the guy we were talking about, that outstanding athlete for the Maui High Sabres, Sawani Bauhea. And he's standing out near midfield. And the kick is blocked. And it's going to be downed by the Na'ali'i around the 12-yard line. Coming in to block it for the Maui High Sabres was Alexander Vinicolo. Na'ali'i nine-yard line. Boy under center, takes the snap, and he will give it to Onosai Imaleo, tries to stiff arm his way around the left side, and he does, and he takes it into the end zone, and Maui High is on the board first here. 9.08 remaining in the first quarter. It's 6 nothing. Sabres on top. Wilhelm will try to add, add on the extra point here. Takabayashi is the holder. Here's the snap. The hold is there for him, and he splits the uprights, and it's 7 to nothing. Oh, second down and 10. Hoy under center. Two men in the backfield. Hoy will hand it off. Onosai Imalio, big hole on the left. He's got the first down and more as he carries out to the Sabre 45-yard line. Valhea now on the right side wing. Two men in the backfield. Boy takes the snap, gives it to Valhea on a little counter play, and boy, he is off and running. He is to the 30. He is gone. 15, 10, 5, into the end zone. Touchdown. Soani Valhea from Maui High takes it 44 yards for the second touchdown of the night for the Maui High Sabres. Takabayashi to hold on the kick by Wilhelm. The kick is up. The kick is good. Single man in the backfield. Akahi takes the snap, wants to throw. Pressure comes in. He gets away from one guy and then is tracked down. And then a whole group of blue jerseys drives him to the ground back at the 25-yard line. Austin Hoy under center. Mapamui wide to the right. They got Wilhelm on the left side wing. Hoy drops back, wants to throw downfield. Pressure comes in, though, and he's wrapped up, and he's dropped back at the 40-yard line. Well, maybe the offense wasn't getting things done, but the defense stepped up here and comes up with a big sack of Austin Hoy. On the left side wing. Hoy is under center, two men in the backfield. And on the counter, it goes to Valhea, follows the blockers, breaks a tackle, breaks another tackle, and works his way to the 41-yard line. Two men in the backfield. Hoy will take the snap, gives it to the inside man, and, and Onosai Imaleo is stripped of the ball. It goes forward up to about the 32-yard line. No indication. We had no indication from our officials who came up with the recovery. And they say first down Maui High as the safe field. Third, a second down and 10. Boy takes the snap, hands it off, and the running back grabbed from behind and then is brought down up around the 28-yard line. That'll be a gain of five. And I believe it was Lotolelli on the carry. And we'll answer that question or at least discuss it when we come back. Right now, we've got the end of our first quarter. And after one here at War Memorial Football Stadium, it is Maui High 14 and King Kikalike 0. We'll be back with more after this. Our fourth quarter of play, Maui High on top 14 to nothing. Sabres with the ball. And a handoff. And picking up big yardage from Maui High is Lusitania Tongi. And Tongi's got the first down for Mui Spitz wide to the right. They got Valhea on the left side wing. Two men in the backfield. 
McCoy takes the snap, hands it off, and coming to the near side, then turning it back up field inside the five. Daniel Kelly on a solid run, and in the three of the Na'ali. Valhea in motion, but the handoff inside goes, and it is into the end zone. Touchdown, Maui High. Ino, uh, Onosai Imolio on the carry that time. Has just gotten nothing done, and that's put the defense out there for a long, long time already in this ball game. Bad snap. Takabayashi comes away with it and then throws into the end zone, and Tristan Nichols grabs it for the two-point conversion. There's the athleticism of the big boy. Well, I guess that's what happens when you target number nine. Having a bigger gathering? They can hook you up with platters. Takamiya Market, the little giant in Happy Valley. This is MIL Football on Maui's ESPN and ESPNMaui.com. Maui High kickoff goes down the left sideline, almost goes out of bounds. Jacob Ramo grabs it. He had to because... Trying to take it back, back to the middle of the field where he was looking and got wrapped up and dropped all the way back at the seven-yard line. That's tough. When things aren't going your way, they're just not going your way. That kick. Akahi takes the snap and then hands it off. And it's Ramos trying to stiff arm his way out of trouble. And he takes it to the right sideline. Couldn't turn the corner and actually goes out of bounds right around the one-yard line. He was very close to going out of bounds from back in the end zone. Akahi in the shotgun with two men back there with him. He wants to throw after taking the snap. Pressure comes in. He heaves it down the right side. He's got a man out there, but the pass is intercepted. It is intercepted and then coming in with a late hit as one of the Maui High players. They send Valhea in motion, and he will take the handoff coming across the backfield, turns it upfield across the 35, and then stacked up. And then the ball comes out. There's a mad scramble for it. The question would be, was Valhea's forward progress stopped before that ball came loose? There was Boy again in the shotgun formation from Maui High. Takes the snap, wants to throw, fires to the right side, going to, I believe that's Nichols, the tight end. And he's made the catch and is knocked down along the sideline up around the 33-yard 30, line. Once again, Valhe in motion, fakes the handoff to him and then hands it off to Kelly. Kelly up the middle, to the 30, to the 25, 20. Down the left sideline, stays in bounds, and then takes it into the end zone. Touchdown. 32 yards on the play for the touchdown. I think that might have been it. Wilhelm will add on the extra point. The kick is up, and the kick is good. And so that makes the score 29 to 0. A couple of guys go back anticipating a punt from Kinki Kalike. Akai takes the snap and then takes off running with it. He's going to try to pick up the first down, and he's going to be close. It's going to depend on the spot as he dives across midfield. He needed to get to the 49-yard line of Maui High, and I think he got to, I think he's going to be about a foot short or so. I don't think he got it. And definitely with the spot that they gave him, he did not get it. Want any any kind of momentum going into the locker room at the half? Their defense has been on the field a long time already in this first half. Sabres come up to the line of scrimmage. Plenty of time on the play clock. Valhea splits wide to the right side. Wilhelm to the left. You know, Imolio and Kelly in the backfield, along with Hoy, who's in the shotgun. He'll take the snap. He wants to throw. Fires on the left side. He's going for Tristan Nichols. He's got it at the 25. He's to the 10, 5, stumbles forward to the one-yard line. Tristan Nichols, the big boy again with those soft hands. And Hoy put that one over everybody right into those soft hands. Looks like he may have come down hard. Looks like he might have hyperextended his right knee a little bit there when he came down. But um, that is the definition of lumbering. 
And unfortunately, Tristan Nichols shaken up on the play. And he was trying to walk, and now he is just on the Atongi is back there with him. They'll have Wilhelm in motion. He'll take the handoff and then turns it straight up field. And then he goes into the end zone for the touchdown. And media group, Paul and Gwyn Phil Mart Oriental in fast food. And we'll get the rest of them after this kickoff. And we have the Sabres kicking off, and it'll be picked up at the 8-yard line. And I believe it's Corey Brown with it, brings it back across the 20-30. He's got open field. He's to the 40. Finally, it's upended by the kicker, Wilhelm, up at the 47-yard line. Nice return by Corey Brown. Okay. Four minutes to go here before halftime. Sabres leading 35-0. Two receivers left, one right. Two men in the backfield along with Jesse Chavez who takes the snap. Chavez looks and fires left. This one's going to be picked. No, it is in incomplete. And the one guy that knew that pass was on the way out to the left side flat was Justin Carvalho, the defensive back from Maui High. He just couldn't get there in time, but I don't think the receivers were aware that ball was coming their way, Mark. I think there was some confusion about... Now Hoy under center this time. He'll take the snap, and he comes away without the ball, and King kekaulike has got it. There was some confusion, just out of desperation, trying to get rid of those. Chavez ready to take the snap, has to burn it in motion, but the pitch will go back to Day, and he is met immediately in the backfield. This time it was Lucas Johnny Ibanez. Got a minute left here in the second quarter. 35-0 Maui High on top. Looks like uh, King K is setting up for a 50, what's it, 52 yard field goal? It that appears to be that way. This could be a hefty, uh, hefty kick. And let's see who's doing the kicking. Is it Corey Brown? I believe that's Corey Brown going to kick right. with Taberna, the holder. And it will be a 52-yard field goal try if he's actually going to try to kick it or are they going to fake it here on fourth down? The snap, the hold, the kick on its way. And it's going to come up short of the, it's in the end zone. It is returned by Takabayashi out of the end zone. And he will take it down the left sideline and is out of bounds around the 40-yard line. Now, I don't... Can he actually return it from the end zone? There is a penalty flag on the field. You cannot return a kickoff from the end zone. I don't believe you can return a field goal attempt from the end zone in high school football. So we have a penalty flag down, but it's out near the line of script. So now they're going to say the ball is dead in the end zone. That's what they're saying. So after the play, we have unsportsmanlike conduct, though, against both teams. So probably a couple of guys locking. 35 to 0, Maui High on top of King Kalike. The team's head to the locker rooms. We are at halftime of this one. Boy, calls for the snap. He's got it. He wants to throw. Fires down the, off to the right side. And the pass is off the defender's hands. Then grabbed by Valhea. He's going to spin and then tripped up at the eight-yard line. And, oh, I tell you, that is just... That, that play epitomizes the way the game has gone for Kinke Kalike. The defender was there. Looked like he was going to intercept it. It skips off his fingertips. And right there to grab it is Valhea. And he takes it all the way to the eight. First and goal to go for Maui High. Boy, out of the shotgun has ball hair in motion, but he gives it to Kelly. Kelly is brought down immediately, and there's your man, Mark. Kanoa Y. Dixon. Knifes his way into the backfield, and the Y. Dixon making the tackle. A loss on the play of a couple, I believe. Third down and goal. Going to keep it on the ground. Ima Leo straight up the middle into the end zone. Touchdown. Onasai Ima Leo on the inside handoff. And he had running room. Good job of the get a good snap. It's one part of the game that has not worked well tonight. They do here. And the hold is down for Wilhelm. And he splits the uprights to make it 42-0. 
Chavez in the shotgun formation. Takes the snap, wants to throw, looks right, throws right. has got a man, the catch is made. And it looks like it's going to be short of the first down, though. Team for Kinky Kalike. Chavez ready to take the snap, does so. And he hands it off and running and breaking loose finally and all the way out to the 35-yard line on the run for Kinky Kalike at La Akea Day in the slot. Chavez rolling out to his right, wants to throw, and the ball gets knocked away from him. It's on the ground, and I believe Kinki Kalike has recovered the fumble. Wilhelm will set up in the shotgun formation. Bauhea in motion, then he comes and gets the handoff, takes it around the left side, met the backfield, slips one tackle, comes back to the inside, takes off, puts on the speed, and is finally upended at the 26-yard line. That'll be a first down for Maui High. And so only Bauhea shows is why he is such a dangerous runner. And we reserves in the game at this point. First and 10 from their own 25-yard line. Wilhelm wanting to throw, fires, and the pass is almost picked off. It went through the hands of the intended receiver, and then I believe it was Higashi almost came up with it for Kinke Kalike. Just as he was starting to get his hands on it, he got popped to the ground and wasn't able to hang on to it. The shotgun formation, Paul Hea splits wide to the right. They got a false start by the receiver on the left, but it's not called, and now Wilhelm just takes off running with it. He is all the way up inside the 20 and finally brought down around the 10-yard line. Oh, they're, they're hurting. Wilhelm under center, hands it off in the backfield after taking the snap and getting tossed to the ground is Tongi. And let's see, was that the Chevy Vieira yeah, coming up defensively? Great defensive play. Wilhelm under center. Little counter play goes to Valhea. Lots of green pasture in front of him, and he takes it into the end zone for another touchdown. Holder. Here's the snap, the hold, the kick, and it hits the right upright. You're listening to MIL Football on Maui's ESPN and ESPNMaui.com. 